Good day uh, YouTube, this is Artanian speaking here and today I'm going to take you on a quick tour of my uh, the home I built on the Dutch server. We were experiencing some rendering options before so we kind of lost the video and we will make a tour again rather soon I hope. Anyway I'm going to start off showing you my home uh, which is actually uh, somewhat hidden underwater. Um, as you can see, this is the entrance here. There's no other way to get in there except for destroying things. And I will get very mad if you do stuff like that, so please don't. Uh, well, small little entrance hall, chest with some random stuff in it, but this is the, um, this is the whole way towards my beautiful home. Um, and I've been trying to use some of the mechanics to uh, work in my favor. I've been playing a lot of into controller blocks and um, there are some things to throw you off here. So that's that room doesn't go anywhere. There's nothing here, so the well, only way to get in actually is through this door. Which we're going to do and this will end you up in this chamber here. Um, Apparently these furnaces are very attractive, everybody needs to check them out at least once, but uh, they're completely empty and they will always be. So yeah, um, this room apparently is the only room in my home. Um, there's no way to get anywhere else it would appear. No doors, no levers, no nothing. Um, that's where these pressure plates come in. Pretty much all of them are completely useless, except for this one. Uh, what's, that? what's that one? This opens uh, a door right here, so we're going to walk through there. And just behind us, we can get out if we need to. And it will lead us on towards this hallway right here, uh, which has a lever. Now this lever is uh, a rather cool thing because it keeps. I can show you. It keeps. No, that door shuts and now it opens again. Um, it appears that it does very little. Not, nothing changes in the room except for all this lever over here. Activating that lever causes this door to open or wall to disappear, depends on your fancy, and it allows you to pass into the second room. Um, as you can see I'm using the painterly texture pack and uh, I really like the paintings here, so I couldn't help but um, yeah, use them to make uh, make another room, especially the Kirby painting is very awesome and the center so well. Um, I'll show you again to how to get through this door. If you're wondering what the ground is made of, um, this is made of stones, just your regular uh, stones, uh, chests. Why did I say stones? This ch this floor is made of glowstone, that's for one, and chests, as you can see, for the other. Um, Okay, so the way to get through this room is by finding the right painting, which you can pass through uh, using the hidden door, and you will find a lever. Now, this opens the door somewhere. Uh, as you can see, it's really hard to find. It's, in, it's not in the image now, or well, the wall is in the image, and now you can enter the next room. Um, some people might figure this out rather quickly because it's right on the opposite uh, camouflaged rather well. It has another switch which also makes uh, another wall disappear, which is right over here. Uh, again, camouflaged. And the last switch um, reminds you of the previous room. However, um, it's not at all that obvious. Uh, again, this makes a switch appear. That switch. Um, which just screws people over most of the time. Um, yeah, so that's the way to get through this room, finding the three hidden switches. And you can get through a cool hallway here, on towards, well, the, the, the next room. And I must add, uh, this is a work in progress, uh, so far. 
Um, because, well, uh, I've been playing around a little bit only yesterday, and I'm pretty sure this is what I'm going to keep, but there's nothing after this room yet. So, uh, I'm going to build a home. Got some decent plans for that. Uh, and I'll show you that later, of course, but first I'm going to let you see this room. Uh, now, this is magma in it, so it wouldn't be wise to start destroying stuff. It would flood the room and uh, yeah, you, you get a, a little bit sad. Um, now, I'll show you the trick I def I've done in this room. is um, There are two switches here. If you open one, you're pretty much screwed because it's a trap door. As you can see, it will... Uh, you will hate me. It's a rather deep magma pit and there's no way to get out of there if you fall in. You'll just die. So, floor is back. Um, however, if you activate this switch... Um, let's show that again. This removes uh, glass and stone. So you can pass underneath the lava and uh, into well, what's going to be my home. Um, so that's the tour so far and... I'm going to show you everything you need to know to lock this place up again, which is going to be in a rather high speed. So, um, let's do that and then I will um, say the last things I have to say. Lock that and here we go. Oh, before I keep on spinning on like this, uh, I would like to add another interesting feature. Um, of the controller blocks, if you use a lever um, to hide another lever, controller block to hide a lever, this automatically removes the lever and shuts down the wall again. Uh, however, if I want to open this, uh, I need to switch this back up and find the uh, other lever again. Really interesting system in my opinion, and uh, really worth it. Uh, to play around with, so yeah. Okay, uh, fast forward again. Okay, so now we're almost back at the, the hallway where we started our nice little quest. Um, I'd like to thank you very much for watching, uh, and I hope you think uh, this is an interesting feature I've been using here. Um, press like if you like this video, subscribe if you like our channel, and most of all, leave a comment uh, about what I should do, uh, kind of in my decoration style of my home. Um, everything from colors to um, a certain layout, if I should have a library or just a nice art room. Everything, every tip would be very welcome, and I will try to integrate them all. Uh, so, again, thanks for watching, and I hope I'll see you around.